The US military are about to face off against the tripods from War of the Worlds. I was browsing on the Steam Workshop and I came across this epic mod right here. So be sure to go and check it out. You do need the ASV mod to play it, I believe. But look at these tripods. They are absolutely out of this world amazing. And they work so brilliantly. Their, their arms move, their legs move precisely to the ground. They're not like one of those mods where the, the legs are all over the place clipping through the terrain. These are perfect and I can't wait to see what's about to happen. So the US military are about to face off against these tripods. We have lots and lots of US Marines right here. Realistically, they would be the US National Guard. Well, I suppose in War of the Worlds, especially the movie in 2005, it would have been every man for himself because usually I don't think they can actually deploy US Marines on US soil. I think that's more of an overseas thing. But um, in the case of War of the Worlds, I think they would have Every guy would have just become National Guard, wouldn't they? They would have sent everybody against these tripods. So, without further ado, we're going to see who wins this battle. There are five tripods against a whole army of US Marines. We are going to be playing it in slow motion to begin with, because I can imagine it's going to be quite big and quite laggy. But look at the move. Look, they're coming. The tripods are on their way. Look at them. Oh, it's so insane. Look at those legs move. I will try playing as one of them as well. There is only five. We're going to see how long it takes for the US military to take out only five tripods. We have M1 Abrams. We have a ton of reinforcements coming in as well, randomly as well. So I don't know which units are going to be coming. It can be anything from an Abrams to a Bradley. All kinds of modern day US military. These guys are just waiting. Look, they can't believe their eyes. They're just like... What the hell are those things? Uh, maybe we could do a full series on this. I'm super excited to be playing more of these battles. I'm thinking about creating a new series. We're going to be calling it Jabs. G-A-B, well, J-A-B-S, that's it. Just another battle simulation. So I think we're going to be playing all kinds of games, just doing quick battles like this and potentially bringing them into a series if you guys like them enough. But look at this. Their, their lasers work and everything. They've even got shields. So we're going to drop in and play as one of these units just to see what it was like from the 2005 movie, I'm guessing. It was 2005, I believe, with uh, Tom Cruise. And I've tried to recreate that scene look where they were going over the elf uh, to fight the tripods. Look at it. Look how beautiful that looks. They are huge. They're absolutely insane. The lag will die down. There are civilians that are also running to this side of the map trying to get away from the tripods they will be targeted overall I think we're losing a lot of tanks though and we're losing a lot of men I'm super excited to be back into some more of these videos I have got loads planned I've got Lego Star Wars coming up more army men of war we can do something more with these tripods as well I'd love to make a little series with it a little uh, I don't know maybe you know, make a city or something and do the tripods attacking the city that'd be so cool Let's send this guy into battle and see how long he lasts. Oh, the shields are too strong. Reload, reload. Keep going, men. Push forward. Got more reinforcements on the way. They've got all kinds of weapons, look. Primarily the M16A2, I believe, is it? Or the M16A3 or 4. I'm not sure. I need to catch up on my guns. Tell me in the comment section. Definitely got one of these uh, ACOG sights, though. Beautiful, look at those. Tanks have actually moved up right on that. All it takes is one shot from that laser there, that evaporator, to take out the tanks. There goes one right there, look. No! Watch out! They are so cool looking. Take some more shots at it. I wonder how long it would take for us to take out all five of these. I know that we've only got 500 reinforcements inbound, so tell me in the comments. Pause the video right here and tell me who you think is going to win this battle. No! Oh, I'm, I'm going to get targeted next. I don't have to know it. Maybe if we shoot them in the legs. What if we shoot them in the legs? Yes! They've got no armor on their legs. Right, this calls for uh, playing as one of the vehicles. Let's retreat our guy out there, see if we can keep him alive. Right, we need a willing Abrams. You, sir. We're going to test the legs. Right, aim. 
We got a shot on his legs. It didn't do anything. The legs are still intact. We'll take a pot shot at this as well. See, what if we shoot him in his eye? Maybe if we shoot him right there, it might do some damage. I think we're still reloading. There we are. Just gotta wait for us to reload. We'll let him reload himself. Oh, it's because it's in slow motion. They took out a part of my house. This isn't good. So these houses right here, I've tried to uh, replicate. Do you know that scene where you have the guy holding up the rifle in the in the air, saying, "Quick, I'll take you to cover." So this, I, I think it looks quite similar. You know, I genuinely think it looks very similar to the movie. Have we got any more reinforcements moving up? We've got a lot of infantry, a lot of civilians retreating as well. But I'm not seeing any armor. We need to bring some more armor in. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's up to the AI. The AI will decide. I wonder if that guy's still alive over here. Most of his squad have been taken out. We've got one guy right here. Look. Oh, their, their shields are just too much. Oh, took his head off. Okay, so it's a little bit more gory than what it was back in the movie, but uh, never mind. In the movie, they literally just turned to dust, didn't they? Uh, also, if you want to see more sort of like uh, fantasy style battles, uh, I, I did do a Godzilla one. So I'll link that in the top right corner right here. So if you want to see Shin Godzilla, Godzilla, who's Godzilla? Godzilla versus the US military. Very similar video. Uh, be sure to go and check it out. Obviously a mortar isn't really going to do much damage. If an M1A2 Abrams isn't doing any damage, I don't think a mortar is going to do anything. Have we taken out at least one of them, surely? Oh, this guy's got the right idea. That will come out from the ground. So. <laughs> and that's what they wanted to do. That psycho who was like, I want, we're going to dig underneath the ground and we're going to come up and we're going to ambush those. I think, what did they actually want in the movie? I think it was something to do with the... Uh, the water or, or human blood or something I'm not sure but they had, they had all those sort of like roots growing all over the place so maybe we could make like a map like that I'm pretty sure I could do it where we could do like all those blood tubes growing across the ground and we could turn it into a real post-apocalyptic series that would be super cool Tanks don't seem to be doing any damage whatsoever on this flank. What's left of them anyway? We need some more to come up from over here if we can. We've got some infantry moving up. Um, I'm pretty sure I placed some rocket launchers. I'm not sure. Maybe this guy. Maybe this guy is the, uh, the substitute for the rocket launchers. Just going to wait for him to reload. Oh my god, even their little teeth things move. Civilians running for their lives. There we go, we're gonna take a shot. Oh, which one? This one. Missile away! No, his shield's still intact. As if we can take out their shields. Um, by the way, if, if the ASV guys can pull off something like this anyway, uh, Im imagine what they could do for the Star Wars mod as well. We're going to be seeing some epic things uh, for Men of War and Call to Arms in the future, I assure you. Got some more guys running. Like I say, all the links are in the description as well if you want to go and check this mod out. Download it for yourself. I might even link this battle and map as well so be sure to check the description if I do forget just remind me in the comments and uh, I will see it and I'll put it in there because all you'll need to do I think is activate the ASV mod then you just need to activate the War of the Worlds mod on top of that and then everything else is just uh, vanilla call to arms I don't think the uh, US military stand a chance at the moment to be honest not unless we could bring in some more armor Maybe some Apaches. Maybe we could do that in the next video. Maybe we could bring some Apaches up. In fact, I'll tell you what, we're going to do that. Let's do it. Let's take out one of them. That's good. Alright, let's uh, take out the other one. Take out his, uh, what should we call it? His shield. And then we should be able to uh, end this battle with a uh, US military victory. I think it's because we took him from behind. Oh, we need some missiles. This is no good. We need to switch to missiles. 
So is it number two and number three? So if we go to number two, that's it. This time's away. That's it, we're doing it. Let's get a bit higher. A little bit higher, and we've got this. Wait, maybe number three. What about number three? This is so epic. Dodging the lasers. Oh no! Oh oh! Don't crash, don't crash into it. I wish we could go a little bit higher. That would help. Oh, we can! We can go higher! I was pressing the wrong button the whole time. <laughs> Go this way, turn, turn the helicopter. Yep, the other one's down. We've got two dead tripods down there now. Now, last but not least, it's this one. We've got some more armor moving up as well. There goes the third. And we're going to watch this one be taken out from the ground, I think. Let's watch it from the uh, military's perspective. This guy. The helicopter appears to have uh, froze. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Oh! My guy got killed. That's not good. Maybe this could be the shot that ends it all. Is he reloading? Oh, another Abrams moving up. Well, the shield hasn't even been damaged on this thing. I think realistically... Uh, we'd have to have some sort of mothership and uh, take that one out. I think it was different. I think the book was like they installed a virus of some sort, or like the earlier movies. And uh, in the later movie, they just took out the mothership, didn't they? Well, the mother tripod. Here comes another one. All for one, one for all. Let's see if we can play as the tripod now. There we go. We're playing as the tripod. I can't see anything. What if we zoom in? That's a bit better. Take the helicopter out. Oh, the helicopter's a beast. Oh, he is going down. Goodbye, helicopter. I can't see where I'm shooting get some of these civilians that are running. What about you? Do they target them if I press that? I love how the little arms move as well, that's so cool. Don't underestimate the mortar. Fire the mortar! Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is! Let's get it! One shot! I wonder if it'd be funny if it did take it out. A direct hit. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, it's taken so much just to take out this last one. He could finish us off, you know. I think the tripods have a strong chance of winning this. Because we're going to run out of uh, reinforcements very soon. Oh, he's targeted me. No. Oh, we've got another one of our uh, Humvees coming in. We've got so many tanks over here. Right, we're going to line them up. We're going to line them up over here if we can. Let's go out. Let's go out slow motion now. We're going to go to full motion. We're going to line them up if we can, and we're going to get all these tanks to shoot at the same time. Everybody, shoot that thing at the same time. That's what we need to do. Oh, we've got another Bradley coming up as well. Now that is gonna that's gonna go down any second now. There's no way it can withstand all that firepower. Caught another wave. Shoot. There we go. Yes, the shields are out. I think we've destroyed it. And there we go, it's dead. So that was epic. So like I say dudes, be sure to go and check this mod out. Uh, um, <laughs> literally hats off to the creator. It looks absolutely epic what they've done so far. 
Um, I don't think there's anything else you really need apart from some really cool skins. Maybe we could do some other battles with it as well. Maybe try and do uh, Godzilla versus the tripods. That'd be interesting. Uh, that's if we could, because it's hard to merge two mods together sometimes. But overall, yeah, just let me know what you want to see in the comments. Uh, I'm Mike Map123, and I will see you all in the next one.